geeks of the internet, my name is Meg and I just got lots of fandom -y things, lots of books and nerdy stuff. Yay, that was my song. I hope you liked it. So this month I went to Hot Topic, Barnes & Noble, Half Price Books, Books A Million, and I had my birthday. So lots of stuff. So let's start with Hot Topic. I got two little mystery toys, a Star Wars and a Guardians of the Galaxy. As you can tell, I have not opened them yet, so check back next time to see what they are. Also from Hot Topic is this Mischief Managed shirt. I got it for my birthday, but it had a Hot Topic tag on it, so I'm gonna say that's a pretty good indicator that it's from Hot Topic. Next I went to BAM, aka Books A Million. I love pins. I used to put them all over my backpack, so I got pins. I got Captain America because Team Cap. May the math times acceleration be with you because I'm a nerd. And I got a Deathly Hallows pin because I didn't have any Harry Potter pins and that was not acceptable. I don't actually know where this is from, but I got a Jordy Funko Pop. Oh, he's so cute. One of my friends saw him at the store and was like, hey, I know somebody who would like that. So she got him for me because she is the best. Next I went to Half Price Books and I got all these Miss Marvel comics. Ah! I read through all of these and I really enjoyed them. They are about this Muslim American girl who finds herself with the ability to embiggen, basically like stretch or enlarge different parts of her body or she can just become really big or really small. And she's trying to figure out how to balance family life, religious life, high school life, superhero life, and I think they're really cool. And finally we have my book haul. This month I went to Barnes & Noble. I got The Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy by Douglas Adams and oh my goodness, I don't know how I had not read this yet. I had heard people talking about it forever and I finally picked it up and basically it's just weird, quirky sci-fi. I'll talk about it later in a reading wrap-up, but I really enjoyed this. Also from Barnes & Noble, I got The 100 by Cass Morgan. I have also already read this. It shows you how long it took me to put together this haul video. To horribly oversimplify it, um, the human race is now on a spaceship. They're waiting to see when Earth will be inhabitable again. And they decide to launch this project where they will send 100 criminals under the age of 18 to Earth to see if they survive. So basically it's a futuristic Lord of the Flies. I will also talk a little bit more about this in a June reading wrap up, but overall I really enjoyed it. And the last one from Barnes & Noble, Me and Earl and the Dying Girl by Jesse Andrews. I have not read this one. All I know is that it's about a kid who makes friends with a girl with cancer and it's probably gonna be sad. And for my birthday, I got Off the Page by Jodi Picoult and Samantha Van Leer. It is the sequel to their previous book, Between the Lines. And in Between the Lines, this girl falls in love with this character in a book, Prince Oliver. And she's trying to figure out how to get him out of the book and into her world. And, spoiler alert, in the end she succeeds. So this book is about Oliver, you know, learning how to deal with the real world. And also for my birthday I got The Rest of Us Just Live Here by Patrick Ness. So basically these kids live in the town that all of the stories happen to. All of the vampires and werewolves and demons and gods and goddesses kind of show up every few years and mess with life around there, but it's never about the people in this book. It's always the indie kids, the kids that are involved in the story, the chosen one. And this group of kids is just living there, just trying to make life work, just trying to get through high school without getting blown up. I enjoyed it, I will talk about it more in a reading wrap up video. And those are all of the books and fandom merch items that I got this month. If you've already read any of these books, tell me what you thought of them, and yep, that's it. I will see you next time.